Hey guys, it's Jennifer from J Blood Fashion, and I am back with my second Christmas DIY of this year. And I'm very excited to be sharing yet another ornament DIY. It's similar to last week, but two different characters this time. Instead of doing minions, I am doing um, a DIY on how to make your very own Mike Wazowski from Monsters Inc. and Olaf the Snowman from Frozen. So let's just jump right into the DIY. Alrighty, so let's start off this DIY by making our very own Mike Wazowski. So, um, I actually colored him green last year, so I don't have any footage of how I did it. But I'll talk real quick on how I did, just so I can give you an idea of what I did. Uh, does that make sense? Anyways, um, what I did was I got a glass ornament, and I found a green crayon. I put it inside the glass ornament, and I used a hairdryer to melt the crayon inside of the ornament and it gave off this cool um, marbly effect and I really like how it turned out. Unfortunately, I can't make a tutorial on how to do it because I don't have any glass ornaments at the very at this very moment. But um, again, it'll be a lot easier if you already had a green ornament to begin with or you can even color the ornament using paint or like I did in my previous video, tissue paper, anything to make the ornament green or like a green ornament you should be set, you should be good to go. But if you do want to try this melted crayon effect, just make sure the ornament is glass, just so that it doesn't melt, because plastic ornaments melt under heat. Fun fact. So keep that in mind, make sure the ornament is glass if you want to try the whole melted crayon thing. So the next part is pretty much self-explanatory. Um, all you gotta do is paint in the details. So I started off by painting the eyeball. So what I did was use a bigger circle to paint the white part of the eyeball. Let that dry. Paint a smaller circle that is blue. Let that dry. And then painted a smaller circle that is black and let that dry. And there you have his eyeball. And then the next part is um, his mouth. And I wanted him to be a smiley, a smiley guy because, I mean, it's Christmas, so you kind of want to be happy. Anyways, so what I did was I painted a smiley using black paint, and then I filled it in um, with some teeth, and I used white paint for his teeth, and I did like little half circles, and those were his teeth. So I did little three half circles on the top of his mouth and then three half circles on the bottom of his mouth and there you go. You have yourself a smiley white uh, 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 sorry, a smiley Mike Wazowski to put on your tree this year. So the next DIY is how to make your very own Olaf the Snowman. Do you want to build a snowman? <laughs> I'm sorry, I just had to. It comes naturally when you think about Olaf. The song just comes to mind and... Anyways, sorry about that. 
Um, so let's start off this DIY. So um, it'll be a lot easier if you already have a white ornament, but I don't have any, so I'm using a clear ornament and I'm filling it up by using um, cotton balls. I feel like the cotton balls kind of imitate snow in a way. I don't know. That might just be me. But you can also, um, if you don't have a white ornament already, you can also fill up the ornament using white paint, white tissue paper, whatever. As long as the ornament is white, you're good to go for this Olaf the Snowman uh, DIY. Alrighty, so the next step is to, um, well, what I'm doing is looking up a picture of Olaf and roughly sketching out his facial features. He has a really strange mouth shape when he's smiling, so I was trying to roughly sketch that out. And I also sketched out the eye and um, his teeth and I think his eyebrows as well. Um, it just gives you an idea of what he looks like and what shapes you need to cut out, etc. Yada, yada, yada. So after you're done sketching it out, um, you can go ahead and cut those sketches out and we're going to use those sketches as a template. So all I did was place the rough sketches that I cut out and place it on top of felt and I used it as a template and basically cut along the template to make sure I got the right shapes and the right sizes. So you basically do that with all of Olaf, all of Olaf's, that's a hard sentence, all of Olaf's facial features um so you cut out the mouth the, the his teeth his eyes all that fun stuff with um by using your template on felt You can also cut out like a triangular shape um, orange felt piece and that could be all of nose but I want to do it like a kind of 3D effect where it kind of pops out at ya. So what I did was cut a piece of orange felt and I rolled it up so that it's pointed on one end and it kind of makes it into like a cone shape and then I made sure to glue it down and I cut the end of it so that it's more straight and easier for me to glue down onto the ornament.
Alright, so once you're done cutting out all the felt pieces, you can go ahead and glue them all down, and you're basically done. Well, I forgot to mention actually. You should uh, probably cut out three pieces of pipe cleaner to put on top of his head and glue it there, because that will be his hair. I totally forgot to mention that. But yeah, so once you glue down his facial features and his hair, um, you're done. You got yourself your very own Oh, the Snowman to put in your Christmas tree this year. So yeah, that is all for today's DIY. I hope you all enjoyed this DIY. I hope you guys enjoyed making your very own Mike Wazowski and your very own Olaf to put in your tree this year. It was definitely fun, and I definitely like how they turned out. I think it's so cute, and I think all these cute characters like the Minions, now Olaf and Mike Wazowski, I think they're going to look adorable on my tree this year, and I'm super excited about that. So I hope you guys are just as excited. So I guess that is all for today's DIY. So, um, yeah. Thanks for watching everyone, I hope you all try it out, and I guess I'll see you later. Bye!